so happy to get started here with you guys and we are going to learn about how to highlight and contour and we call this hacking or hack highlight and contour um, and it's going to involve these three colors okay and then we're going to toss on lip and cheek at the end for fun okay so let me explain the highlights and contour and I haven't told you this already. I mean, how cute. It doesn't love that. Anywho, so we have two highlights, okay? I know it's confusing, but stick with me. We have a brightener highlight, which is a lighter. I call it a brightener highlight. It's a, the lightest shade in your compact. You're going to use that as like kind of a concealer you're gonna brighten your face think of it like that then you have your main highlight which is like your foundation shade these two work together to create your foundation and then your contour um, is obviously your contour but the cool thing about this is you don't have to layer it at all so you just place everything where it belongs and blend it and it's super, super easy. So I'm gonna teach you how to highlight and contour. Okay, let's do some contour 101 real quick. So I like to put contour on first. It's a little thicker in consistency. So I just like it to sit there and melt on my face while I apply the rest of my makeup. But I'm gonna place this temple to temple. Okay, just gonna dip it in, cheekbone, cheekbone. This is optional. I say that because it just takes me so long to do nose contour sometime. Um, and then you're gonna line your jawline. And then I like to kind of like outline my lips a little bit. Not quite that much, but that's more like it. Okay, so you're making your forehead smaller, your nose slimmer, your cheeks lifted, like your face is gonna be lifted, and your jawline is gonna be more chiseled with the contour. So this is the contour part of hacking. Next up, I am going to switch the brush, brush over. It doesn't matter. You can use whatever sides. Um, but I'm, I'm going to switch this over and I'm going to tap in to my highlight that is the lightest shade, my brightener highlight. And I am going to put this like, kind of like under my eyes, right? Like a concealer. We want to brighten and bring attention to the center. Boom, I'm gonna put some in the center right there. Down our nose, Cupid's bow and chin. <laughs> okay, that's how easy that is, okay? No layering needed. Next up, main highlight. This is the shade that is closest to your skin tone. So I'm gonna dip into this and you're just gonna see me kinda like fill in the gaps pretty much. Okay. And there is your highlight and contour. But before blending, you don't even have to wait for lip and cheek. Put it on. It has coverage too. Boom. Boom. Okay. And we are going to blend this out so there's no science to blending I mean I don't think there is but you can use one side of your brush both sides cream does not transfer very easily you can go in whatever order you can go in whatever order you want I tend to go lightest to darkest but you'll find your groove I promise so here we go I like to kind of take the like corner here and kind of like press that in 
you really want to melt this help assist melting this into your skin okay get that really good under your eye because you don't want it to crease okay just gonna blend some of that out This is the 3D brush, which is what I usually have most people start with. However, mature skin and people who like full coverage may want to look into different brushes. But we can talk about that on a case by case. Blend up into your hairline, okay, up, and it just really, the makeup does it for you. Contour, you want to also blend up, and then you'll just kind of marry it with your contour right there, like, look how stunning it is, okay, up, up, up. Mary. Then I usually clean everything up. Okay, there you guys have it. That is highlighting and contouring. It's so, so simple. And you just need these four colors to start. We can talk more if you want more than the basics, but I just want to show you guys at first sight, this is what you're dealing with. And it's so amazing. It's so easy. So I cannot wait to get you guys all started.